afternoon folks big Bo here with another great diesel motorhome value from parkway rv center folks i'm about to show you an absolutely knock your eyes out gorgeous 2003 winnebago journey dl this is the model 36 gd 36 and a half foot with two slides i'm gonna tell you folks this motorhome's only got 38,000 miles which is absolutely uh extreme low mileage for a diesel and it is fully loaded with options now folks i'm gonna warn you i'm gonna shoot a long video because there is a lot of different things to go over on this rv this is something that somebody's probably going to buy sight unseen because you just don't see these motorhomes in this kind of condition very often the last winnebago journey i had that looked like this in this price range sold in less than 24 hours folks this particular one is a 36 gd it's got a 330 Caterpillar turbo diesel. It's got the Freightliner custom chassis. It's got the Allison 3000 uh, programmable transmission. That's that transmission that actually learns your driving habits and adjusts the shift pattern accordingly. Uh, folks, Winnebago, in my opinion, is just top of the line. I, I've owned two of them myself. Uh, they're actually the only brand that builds 80% of their own parts. They don't buy aftermarket parts like other manufacturers do. One of the few brands that has a standard no maintenance fiberglass roof. I mean, this unit's knee deep in tires. It's the slide outs work perfectly. The jacks work perfectly. It's got patio. Uh, it's got a power patio awning. It's got a power door awning. They're all out right now. This particular unit has also got slide toppers. It's got a 7,500 watt Onan diesel generator with 568 hours on it. For those of you who know diesels, that's absolutely nothing. This is a 30, 40,000 hour generator in a motor home that'll run half a million miles or more if you take care of it. I mean, this is the same chassis you see on big tour buses. And with that big 330 cat, you're not gonna have any problem keeping up with traffic or towing, an arm or towing anything behind. In fact, you've got a 10,000 pound towing capacity, so. Uh, chances are, if you want to tow it, this motorhome can do it. A uh, 10 gallon DSI water heater. I'll show you some of the outside compartments. It's just how clean it is, folks. Open this up. Uh, got a little outside entertainment center with a fold out table. CD stereo, outside speakers. Of course, there's your control box for your awning. And this is what I was talking about how Winnebago builds 80% of their own parts. You see this sticker right here? This is Winnebago's part number on this for this door. It doesn't matter if this thing's a 2003 or a 1973 model. You call Winnebago, you give them that number right there, they're going to send you this exact same door. Now other brands, they buy all aftermarket parts and just assemble them. But Winnebago actually builds motorhomes. So you can rest assured, no matter how old your Winnebago is, chances are you can get the parts for it. Now, you do this with other brands like a Four Winds or a Dutchman or a Forest River. If it's more than a few years old, they're going to laugh you, uh, laugh you out of uh, the dealership when you ask them. But you give them this number right here, Winnebago will send you this exact same door. Uh, I'm going to tell you, folks, everything's insulated well. This was one of their top-of-the-line units. If you went to a new Winnebago dealer in 2003 and said you wanted the best 36-foot they have, the best equipped, and money wasn't a problem, this is what you would have bought. The Winnebago Journey DL is about as nice as you can get without getting into the big 40-foot diesels, the 40-foot plus. Basement, heat, and air. Now, folks, it's starting to rain, so I'm going to get back under this awning. Um, but it does have the basement heat and air, so you've got a little extra hot clearance because you don't have the air conditioners on top. And you get another benefit of that 25,000 BTU air conditioner. You get the fact that it's also an electric heater, so you don't have to use your propane furnace if you don't want to. It does have an electric furnace as well as a propane. Both the awnings are just absolutely like new. And every all this is power. You can control it from the bay right here or by the door. Let me show you some of the features about this 36 GD Winnebago. Folks, first of all, power steps. As we step inside here, folks, I'm going to show you just some of the nice features you get that you don't get. Of course, here is your controls. Of course, I've got some water on it, but that's your controls. 
so you can put your awnings in and out and of course folks we're going to guarantee all the RV components like the awnings to work great and that is the Illumigard awning and you also have you flip the switch right here and you can also bring over the door in and hopefully we won't get wet so I'm just going to bring it in a little bit at a time so we can let the water drip off. And just as easy as that, your awnings are up and ready to hit the road. Uh, notice the nice sculptured carpet. You know, that's, that's strictly for Winnebago. That's that Berber carpet. Another nice feature, if you look right here, you can lock all your bays right here with one button. So if you need to get out here and open your bays, flip that lock switch, it'll lock and unlock them. As we step up in here, folks, it's got a passenger side leather seat that's also a recliner. It's got the audio box, CB radios, they're all in there, all four of them, so you can keep in communications with everybody in your, in your camping party. And that's got a built-in charger. Uh, the seats are absolutely perfect. Remember, this thing's only got 38,000 miles, which is almost like new for a diesel because these diesels can put hundreds and hundreds of thousands of miles on them and still not wear them out. So you've got a lot of life left in this RV. Uh, up here in the front, uh, it's got a Sony color backup camera with sound. Yeah, of course, up here, you've got air horns. They work. Generator. Of course, you can run your battery. Uh, you can run your radio off the house or the engine battery. You've got easy disconnects for your auxiliary battery. You can cut it on or off right there. Of course, your defrost fans, you cut them off right there. Uh, CD tape stereo. It does have the exhaust brake and air brakes. Heated power mirrors, power visors, HWH hydraulic leveling jacks. Like I said, folks, this is a long video because there's a lot of stuff to go over. Uh, you've got the side, you've got the side vents, the side visors, as well as the windshield visors. The glass is absolutely perfect. There's no rock dings, no cracks, nothing like that. The dash is perfect. You know, you can tell when somebody's had cat or dogs in an RV because they'll get up here on this leather dash and scratch it all up. And you can't hide that, folks. But this one here has no scratches. So you can tell they haven't had any animals in here. A leather recliner. This is a table right here that folds up out of the way. And then you can also swivel the passenger side seat around and give you extra seating for two people or eating service for two people you've got a privacy curtain that goes all the way around the windshield okay, you open this up folks here's your electronics VCR a DVD player crossover it does have a manual point satellite dish and then here's just more storage and it's also got connection for an iPod or something like that up there of course, that's your satellite receiver. I mean, great looking RV. I mean, this thing is top notch quality all the way around you look. I mean, this is real ceramic tile floor, sculptured Berber carpet, uh, Corian countertops, four door RV refrigerator freezer with built in ice maker. I mean, the upgrades are just unreal on this. All the fluorescent lighting. Notice the carpeted headliner. This helps reduce road noise and vibrations while you're driving down the road. Another nice feature about Winnebago is their roof systems are legendary. Look at this, folks. You can punch that thing all day long. Nothing vibrates. You do this with a Forest River, a Coachman, or a Dutchman, uh, the light lenses will pop out of the uh, lights because of the vibrations. But this roof is so solid that you can have several people up there if you want to for races, and you're not going to hurt it. Another nice thing, you may have noticed a crown in the roof, the, the angle. This eliminates standing water and, again, helps extend the roof life. You know, this doesn't have a rubber roof, so you don't have to worry about having it serviced every year and conditioned and sealed and all that junk. Uh, this roof will be here from now on. Costs more to do it like that, but, of course, Winnebago... The name that's pretty much synonymous with any Class A motorhome, one of the pioneering brands, they're only going to put the best in their RVs because they've got probably one of the highest reputations in the RV industry to uphold. Uh, even the sofa, look at this, folks. That's nice right there. You can just fold that down, and there's your sleeper sofa. Just push a button. You don't have to get up there and twist and turn and 
and hurt yourself and all that trying to fold the bed out. You just push a button, bed folds in and out. And the next morning, press your button for a few seconds and you're right back to the daytime sitting position. A table booth also makes a bed. And they even put nice little features like uh, somebody sitting here riding down the road. Well, guess what? You've got plug-ins. You've got 12 volt chargers for cell phones. Got a telephone jack, and folks, of course, that's for old school dial-up internet. But like I said, they even think about adding that to their RVs. Solid wood cabinets. These are the same grade you'd find in your own home. Folks, like I said, this is $172,000 new and still has an NADA of over $65,000 as equipped. So this thing is not a cheap grade motor home. It's not an entry model. It's so far from it, it's not even funny. Uh, refrigerator, now I haven't had it on very long, but it does have the built-in ice maker. It is getting cold. It just takes it a little bit. Let me see if it's even showing up yet on my thermometer. Yeah, it's getting cold. It just takes it a while. Yeah, we're already below 50 degrees, so obviously you leave us on a couple more hours, it's going to be ice cold. The roof air is ice cold. It's got the basement air. It's blowing out under 40. So like I said, keeping this thing hot or cool is not going to be a problem any part of North America any time of the year. Like I said, the benefit of that of that basement air, you do get that extra electric furnace, so you don't have to use your propane furnace if you don't want to. Uh, Xantrix inverter, all your gauges work, monitor panel works, everything's empty, and propane's about two-thirds full. 586.6 hours on a 7500 Onan diesel generator, which is absolutely nothing. You've got dual engine heaters, so if you are going to do some wintertime camping up north. You can keep your engines nice and warm. Makes them easy to crank in the morning. Of course, your batteries are good. We're going to make sure all that works well. Uh, you got your energy management system. So if you're on 30 amp or 50 amp, you can control what's on, what's not. Uh, DSI water heater, water pump, and it's got an electric water heater as well. Uh, again, Corian countertops in the bathroom area. Uh, seamless sink. I mean, ceramic tile floor, it's got the glass surround shower, it's got the skylight, no signs of leaks or leak damage anywhere, and this is a Winnebago, folks, they don't leak like other brands do. Uh, upgrade Sealand porcelain RV toilet, plenty of lighting in here, plenty of storage. Now, folks, this unit does have washer and dryer hookups. It's not included with it. Uh, a lot of people, including myself, don't like the washers and dryers because they give no, notorious for giving you problems. And plus, you usually can't run your dryer and your air conditioner at the same time. But this unit does have the hookups. And we'll be happy to add one to it. Just talk to the salesperson when you call and tell them to give you a price on a washer and dryer installed. Of course, I can go to a laundromat at a washeteria at a campground and do six loads of... of six house sides loads of clothing and the time it takes one of those washer and dryers to do a pair of jeans and a pair and a shirt because that's all they'll hold but uh if you've got a need for one folks we can definitely put you one in really nice rear bedroom i like the ceiling fan when's the last time you see a ceiling fan in a class a motor home uh, queen island bed all original bedding it looks great tv DVD player. It's got a crossover box in case you want to hook multiple components up to it. Big closet. Even the nice, look at all the nice lights. Um, accent lighting. I mean, this is a high class motorhome, folks. And I'm going to tell you, it's just got so much going on. And I, I could do a video for two hours on this RV and still not show you everything. Uh, it's got your own stereo here in the back. Uh, you've got dimmers on the ceiling light. So you can adjust the light to suit your mood uh, nice closet area all these closets are lighted too i mean just so much of course here's your stickers showing everything uh 360336 gd folks this is just a nice unit all in all and this is something that's going to last you and your family for many years 38,000 miles on a diesel pusher motor home that can run six seven hundred thousand miles or more 568 hours on a 
diesel generator that'll last you 30,000 hours or more. I mean, there's no way you can wear this machine out. I don't care if you drive 100,000 miles a year, this thing's gonna last you for a decade or more. Only 59.9, folks, that's thousands of dollars under NADA book value. This is just such a nice deal. I think it's gonna sell as quick as our other one within just a day or two. I mean, 38,000 miles on a diesel pusher, that's just ridiculously low miles. And I'm going to tell you, something like this doesn't hit the market every day. These things are bringing 60 grand on the internet with 100,000 miles. And you can buy this one with 38,000 miles for what you're going to spend on a high mileage one. 59.9, we'll trade. We have up to 180 month financing available with approved credit. We've got no extra fees, no dock fees, no prep fees, no dealer fees whatsoever. Rest assured, folks, you're buying from one of the oldest RV dealers in the industry. 47 years, third generation, family owned and operated, used RV dealership. And we're not just a little bitty hole in the wall place. We've got 150 used RVs and over four acres right here, just full of used RVs. They're all priced at the lowest prices on the internet. And there's a reason for that, folks, because we learned a long time ago, and this is actually my grandfather started this place, but he taught my dad, who taught me, that if you price your RVs lower than anybody else in the country, people are gonna come thousands of miles to buy RVs because they're saving thousands of dollars. Uh, and his favorite saying was, you make your dollar with 10 dimes instead of four quarters. In other words, you don't make as much on every RV you sell like the other guys do. I mean, let's be honest, you go to the RV dealers, the big chain dealers, this is a seventy dollars to $75,000 unit all day long. But you sell more. In other words, you make your dollar with 10 sales instead of four sales. Other RV dealers would rather sell just a few and make a ton of money than just instead of like us, where we just make a little bit and we sell a ton of RVs. We sell 500 plus a year. We sell about 15 to 20 a week. And it's not because people like us is because people cannot touch our prices that's why we've been in business for almost half a century that's why this motorhome right here is going to sell within a few days because you're buying a seventy thousand dollar plus motorhome for under 60 with thirty eight thousand miles in absolutely beautiful condition uh, we sell two to three hundred rvs a year sight unseen so if you need us to send you additional pictures we can do that. We can deliver nationwide. We charge you whatever it costs us to bring it to you anywhere in the United States. And folks, I've got five drivers on the road pretty much seven days a week. And chances are, I don't care how far away you live from us, they probably delivered an RV pretty close to you in the past because I sell these things all over the United States. Just in the last 10 years, we've sold in all 50 states and that's including multiple sales to Alaska and multiple sales to Hawaii, Rhode Island, over 2,000 RVs all over Canada, England, Italy. Actually, I've sold two to Italy. Uh, the Netherlands, Chile. I mean, the list goes on and on. Australia, all these places, folks, we've sold RVs to because you cannot touch our prices, even if you have to spend a few hundred dollars to fly in to Chattanooga, Tennessee Airport, which we have four or five buyers a week that do that. We'll pick you up for free at the during business hours at the Chattanooga Tennessee Airport which is 10 miles from us bring you back here my RV techs will go over this RV with you front to back top to bottom and you can drive it home it's as easy as that folks I just give my non-commissioned salespeople a call that's right folks I'm one of the few RV dealers in the United States that has no commission salespeople they're all salary based this eliminates any pressure on you any sales pressure or any dishonest sales tactics because they get paid exactly the same whether you buy the RV you don't buy it it doesn't matter what you pay for it you get paid exactly the same we learned decades ago that's the best way to sell RVs and when you have the lowest prices on used RVs in the country like we do there's no need to pay people to sell your RVs they sell themselves like I said folks you're gonna be really surprised when you do business with us how much money we can save you and how much less stressful of a buying experience it is and that's why we've been in business so many years that's why we sell so many rvs folks and uh, i'm gonna tell you we're, a, we're the one of the few actually as far as i know the only used rv dealership on ebay that's a certified power seller and you only get that you can't buy that you have to sell hundreds and hundreds of used rvs on ebay all with positive feedbacks which we have we're a top rated seller selling used rvs and folks that's a pretty much a Get on our eBay page, look at some of the uh, feedbacks people have left us. You know, 
not anybody can, you know, you go to Google and all these other places, anybody can leave feedback with no verification. They don't know who you are. You can be a competitor. It doesn't matter. But when you go on eBay and you read feedbacks, you're going to see the true story of how a dealership operates because the only way somebody can leave a feedback on eBay is if they buy an RV from that RV dealer. You just can't leave a random feedback on eBay. You have to buy something. So if you want a true idea of how we do business, check out our feedback page. Give us a call. You're going to be glad you did. You're going to save thousands and thousands of dollars. You're going to get a nicer, cleaner, lower mileage RV than you're going to get anywhere else. And the reason being, after 50 years in business, folks, we know where to get the good ones at before the big guys get them. Thank you for watching and hope to see you soon here in beautiful Ringo, Georgia.